Oh. Ooh, I didn't I forgot you could barter for stuff. No more than two fifty. You get two fifty. Two ninety seven is ridiculous. You get two sixty. Final offer. Two ninety four. Three nil points. That's insult. I give you two seventy. What you say? You bitch. We'll go to eighty, but that is no less, or no more, no more than two. This that was it. I got the guy. I got the guy. Is there like a specific way to get back to off the door besides this? <laughs> this is driving me insane. Oh man, you gotta reset me to default, fuckers. Anyway, before I was so rudely interrupted, I was supposed to go here, and then I'm pretty sure I talked to this dude, and he freaks out about shit. Yeah. A pattern of two lines on the front of that old tomb. How intriguing. <laughs> so now that I talk to him, I can... That activates my star chart. So now I can... Boom. 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 Now I'm all coordinated up. Bitches. Bitch ass. Alright, so let me. Let me blast my way back over. Let me rocket my way back over to this to the to the tower of shit thing. Uh Let's rock it. Three, three, five. Whee! It's a little Power Rangers joke for you guys. Power Rangers in space. <laughs> Classic. Anyway, where am I going here? Add star. Is there like an easier way to go about? Nope. Nope. Oh, shit. Shit. What the fuck? Well, forty-three two ninety-nine. Oh my god! Is this like? Is this really how I'm supposed to navigate this bullshit? Hold on. Okay. So if I, nope, nope, nope. Maybe let's put a finer point on it. Nope, still just blocking away. Oh, God. So even though I know where it is now, it's still just as wonky. You can't just move both numbers in, like, bold directions. You gotta, like, help me out a little bit. All right. Slowly shuffle. This is good. This is good. Okay. Okay. Now we gotta get back over to... Okay. This is good. This is good. Okay. 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 This is... I can... I can make something of this. Yeah. There we go. Oh. Then you... Do you... Then, nope, that's not right. 83 to 269. Okay. So that's not going to fly. Oh. Oh, shit, shit. No, 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 no. <laughs> I lost it. I lost it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nope. Just gotta do the thing that I did before. That worked out, right? My life is an unending series of horrors. 
Wow. <laughs> He's just really pleased. Extraordinary. You've identified a constellation based on the darkest fairy. Her eyes, in fact. This, how strange. He stops for a second, staring blankly. You know, I found the oddest feeling that this is familiar. There's something on the tip of my brain. Some piece of information. What is it? Shakes his head. I just can't figure it out. Well, perhaps there are other constellations to be found. Okay, so now... The book is updated with a story... With extra story, extra plot details. Chapter 1. The Sleeper. That picture is a bitchin'. That is a bitchin' picture I know you are saying right now. <gasps> Ooh. Just as a hero, the form of heroic deed before he can be named, blah, 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 was once respected for her deeds. <sighs> Long before the great betrayal, in fact, before the founding of Altador, she earned her place amongst the twelve founders by saving the life of King Altador himself. A terrible menace was plaguing a... Oh, shit. <laughs> was plaguing a peaceful farmland, and a hunter, the future king of Altador, journeyed forth to slay the beast. He tracked it back to its lair in a cave at the base of a mountain, and there cornered it. Though the beast roared viciously, Altador did not falter. What a badass dude. What just like a super serious badass dude. You know? Not scared of shit. Anyway. Rather... He notched an arrow and let it fly, striking the beast squarely in the head. Even as the vile creature slumped to the ground, another of its kind snuck up on the unsuspecting Lupe. The noble hunter would have fallen then and there if not for the purple blast of magic. Startled, Altador spun around just in time to see the other creature collapse. There standing behind it was a dark fairy, the betrayer. Altador thanked her graciously for saving his life. He had never witnessed such compassion on the part of a dark fairy before, so he bid her return with him to his village where they would be feast and be praised as heroes. Each carried the head of the beast they had slain to the village, and grand celebration was held long into the night. Altador, realizing what a unique ally he had acquired, asked her to stay and join him and his companions in fulfilling a dream he had found he had of founding a great city. The betrayer agreed, and though she would ultimately help build the kingdom's august capital and serve the council well, Nothing can make up for her terrible betrayal. She broke the king's heart, for no sword strikes as deep as the one wielded by a friend. That's pretty fucking deep, dude. And, like, can we talk about how over here, the fucking, they call her the betrayer already? Like, that's not okay. She's not the betrayer yet. She is going, she's the, the person to betray. They should have said... Whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm being semantic right now. My semantics are semanting everywhere. What's up, everyone? Thanks for checking out the video. If you want to see some of the other stuff we're doing on YouTube, why don't you hit the subscribe button right over there and keep track of it. Or if you want to see some of the videos we've done already, just uh, check out some of the ones we posted down there for you. And if you want to go to the website and see some of the other great stuff that we're doing, just click here, just in this general vicinity. While you do that, I'm going to go grab a cat. found him. Hi. Hey.